How to make a saw slash router table. The things you're going to need to do it. After you have all that, then screw the table slash leg support together. Then screw the tabletop on. Then assemble the leg support. It's the same support that goes underneath the table. Now you can put the legs on. Make sure you measure with the angle square. Here's what it should look like with all the legs on. Screw the bottom support on. Now stand the table up and screw a hole right in the center of it. Now you can see if your router fits. If it does, then you can plug it in and try it out. Now take your router out and make a quarter inch slice down the middle just big enough for the saw blade. Then test your saw blade to see if it fits. If it does, then screw it to the bottom and then try it out. Now that we know the saw works, you can put a strap around the trigger. So the fence is pretty simple. We basically took a 2x4 and then cut a notch so it would fit perfectly over the clamp. Then apply liquid nails and stick it on. After the saw slash router table is done, then you can install the switch. And now you're done. Thanks for watching.